Because I've not spoken to you guys at all today, I know. It's been a long, long day, okay? But Alhamdulillah, we are currently in Spain. I'm sure you guys can actually, you guys already know from the title of the video, yeah? But yeah, Alhamdulillah, we have arrived in Spain. So, we just got into the hotel. It's been a really long day. So, I'm just going to quickly give you guys the tour of the hotel of the room i'm gonna quickly give you guys the tour of the room so i can get into you know resting now because i'm literally keeping the whole family waiting so let me just quickly give you the rundown of what the room looks like okay <laughs> so once you come in this is what you have this is the entrance entryway so this right here is the wardrobe right um it just has the basic basic amenities obviously this is our stuff i just put those ones in there it has the safe and then those are the bedroom and um yeah a couple of angles as well some sleepers actually just one i think it's two yeah two sleepers then over here there is the bathroom and uh, this is what it looks like i mean it's really nice like and the lightning is amazing as well <laughs> so here there is an air dryer and a couple of towels as well the basin some body lotion and and soap the tissue more towels that's nice and then i'm guessing this ones will be the shower gel yeah shower gel and some shampoo over there oh this is nice it also has this double sink stuff going on here and yeah that is the big top so once you come in once you leave the bathroom there's a mirror here it's quite tiny but it will serve its purpose now i put on the lights please thank you so yeah and then this is the main bedroom this is actually the only bedroom no not just the big bedroom 
then there are just a couple things wall frame some led lamp i think some bedside lamp nothing special there there's actually no storage there over here also some stuff you know coffee blah 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 what's this yeah that's a coffee machine um this is ours this is ours and then they drop this water here as well then there's actually a balcony but i can't show you guys this night because it's late i'll show you guys tomorrow yeah guys so that's pretty much everything about the room i'll see you all tomorrow right now we need to rest rest enough rest so yeah you guys see you all tomorrow i'm actually down obviously because i'm tired talk to you all tomorrow good morning my loves how are you guys doing this is our first morning in spain uh we just woke up not too long ago and this is almost 9 a.m or even after 9 like we actually slept well so anyways you guys um this is the view that i couldn't show you guys yesterday this is the terrace babe it's called a terrace now of a balcony okay this is the balcony that i couldn't show you guys yesterday and we have a beach view right that is the beach over there we are going to go there sometime later try to just enjoy and have some good time so i'll fill you guys in on what we are going to do eventually but right now let's go have our bath and um look like a tourist <laughs> an actual tourist that we are <laughs> so catch you guys later quickly fix a stick on you guys can see but i've not been able to hack how to not have those bubbles you guys can see the bubbles sometimes i do it flawlessly and um it's smooth and hot but sometimes you guys can see this one is actually smooth but others have bubbles this one this one also has some bubbles and i really don't like that i wish i knew how to hack that already but with time i'm going to have I'm going to be able to hack it with time. So if you have the hack to not, you know, on how to avoid bubbles when you apply your stick on, let me know because these bubbles are not cute at all. You guys can see the bubbles. You can see the bubbles here. You can see here. There is also some here which doesn't look nice at all. Can you guys see it? I don't like those bubbles. <laughs> but besides that, the nail actually looks good. I ordered it from... Um, you guys can see the nail looks so good. I wish it doesn't have that no says bubble. I actually ordered it from Shein. Yeah, God, it looks so good. I ordered it from Shein. <clears throat> I ordered a couple of them actually. I brought like three to this trip with me. And um, yeah, I'm about to go get ready. We're stepping out soon. But then I need to film it, get ready with me. <laughs> I like this mirror here as well. <laughs> I need to film it, get ready with me right now, like right about now. But yeah, but I look pink. It's after the get ready with me that I'm going to get rid of this one on my head. I'm going now. I'm going now. So, you guys, I'm done. I'm done with my get ready with me. And we're about to step out eventually to have lunch then we are going to go for one of the sightseeing and i'm definitely i'm going to carry you guys along and up. this is basically what i'm wearing yeah this i think i think i told you guys where this jacket is from already well it's from bashka the top is from sheen my jeans is from h&m and my new balance sneakers the bag is also from sheen looking like a profile Profile tourist, but a sweet one actually. <laughs> you can't believe that the person that I just fixed, one of them has removed life of a person. 
This is why I don't really like press sample. They are lifesavers, sha. Anyways, guys, let's go. you guys I was like that can definitely not be home yeah just some um, oh you can actually play here what on his slide in there Baba like she my boss the other way Abby so so apparently there's still oh there's also a game here by the Luma Bears in the first stop so there apparently there's still some things for the children to play. Cause I was wondering, I'm like, that cannot be called. <laughs> Maybe it's this way. Man, do you want to go under the tube? Yay! Wow! Hey, I come! Yeah. <laughs> Good job, Co -co slide. 
sled. É, é snow sled. Finally, John in the aquarium. Why did she get it? Why did she get it? Not that we could it. Yeah, it's quite difficult. <laughs> Watching Bobo don't use our eyes, see. Today, <laughs> mouth no fit to come. My back. She okay to make baby see you meet her. Ah, God. They will send memories. Travel with your children. Travel with your toddlers. You are making memories. Olay. <laughs> Travel with your toddlers or travel with your kids. You're making memories. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'll catch you when we get to the hotel. Hotel. Okay, one thing that I will actually say is if you want to travel, one of the mistakes that I made is book everything in advance. I mean, I know that for sure, but for some reason, I was just hesitant to do that, and then I was also not feeling too fine. You guys know. One thing that I will say is whenever you want to travel, the things that you would like to do there, like the sightseeing the tourist attractions try as much as possible to book them in advance like now the Sagredalia Familia that I would really really like to go we can't go again because it's literally filled up I think the booking is usually like um at least five days in advance because all the dates that we are seeing now is like five days later and we are definitely gonna be out of here on Sunday so like we're literally seeing dates from Tuesday, Wednesday for that Sagredalia and really it was like top on the list of where to visit but that means that we're not going to be seeing that but anyways so my tip, my number one tip is to book your stuffs in advance so now that has given us, like it has given me some, oh sorry I'm not going to mention the second country yet. Like, this has given me an eye opener to book in advance of the things that we're going to do in the second countries because I'm sure that I've mentioned to you guys that we're actually visiting two countries. So, but I'm not going to tell you guys yet. You are going to find out in another vlog because that's definitely going to be another vlog. So, we've already booked for that one today in advance. So, as to avoid stories that thought she gets. But I wish we had booked for this Saga Italia family. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it well, but you guys should just ignore. So, anyways, we are back in the hotel, obviously. So, they also brought <laughs> baby cuts for me, and it was supposed to be in the room yesterday. But they forgot somehow, somehow. I don't know, Sha. Long story short, they brought it today. I hope this boy is going to sleep in it because he looks so small. Not too small, actually, for his age. But for somebody that is not used to this sort of um, tiny compartment. So I'm going to settle in a little, charge my phone because the battery is down. Charge my camera as well, the batteries. And then we're going to go back out to have dinner. That's pretty much the plan now. So I'll probably catch you guys when we are now our way out again or when we go have dinner. Yeah, maybe one of the two shall. But so far so good. Barcelona has been good. It's just the language barrier that is the issue. Like literally all the things are in um they are written in Spanish. Baby babe. Is it Spanish yeah. Hey, I said literally all the things. I didn't say everything. But normally all the things that they are writing is in is in um, Kenina. 
We only have English here because it's the hotel that we are staying in. So, one thing, one tip, one extra tip is if you are traveling to a non English speaking country, just download this Google Translate. I used it for maybe like one time today. Yeah. But it's, it's actually much easier if you have that on your app. But yeah. One good thing is that the Google map itself is in English, you know. So that's helpful. Definitely because we are from an English speaking country, that's why it's in English. So just download Google Translate if you are going to a non speaking non English speaking country. It's much easier that way. I don't know, Sha. As time goes on, if I remember all of that tips, I'm going to share with you guys definitely things to not do and the things to do just to make your travel easier. Yeah. So catch you guys later, Sha. Like my video at this point if you haven't. Yeah. Say catch you later. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Let me see your nose. Crystal Pavian. No no no. <laughs> Boboni, no, 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 no. Hola. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Hola. Hola. Hello. Hello. Everything is so good. Me, we say normally English men is said it's still very difficult for me. Hi. Oh. Well, this is a catch food today. We have a snapper, salt, oh. fish, and sea bass. Oh. And we got the seafood. The seafood we can do on the grill or we can put it in paella. So the paella today will be with the lime juice and clams, tamales and squid, or with the scarlet shrimps or shrimps and the clams. Or you can fit. Whatever you want, we can put it in paella. For me, the best paella they have is the scallop shrimps and the clams. Also, the sardines on the grill, like the scallops. Yeah. 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 Oh, 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 oh,
No, my look. I'm not done yet. That's small one. That's small one. I'm not a quite baby choice. I'm a baby because we have a toddler, we need to carry his bottle. There's nothing I can do this life. Why do you carry the chest? No money. If I say, because me, I just look the boy say you got my finish. I was like, what can I do without my husband? Yeah, what can I do without you, baby? Yeah. So you guys were stepping out today. Um today's itinerary. I have a couple of um, popular Instagram places to visit today. One of them is the La Sagalia. Hey God. Shoot more coins. Shoot more. La Sagalia. Sagrada Familia. Eh, La Sagalia Familia. No, La Wambe. But me fishing for caramel. La Miss Dina. Eh, Dina. So we're gonna be visiting the La Sagalia Familia today. That was the one I was telling you. What? That was the one I was telling you guys yesterday that we were supposed to book in advance. But oh, I don't know. I didn't book it. So we are just going to try and go there today and see some outside viewing. You know? And hopefully if we can get um, tickets from the box office. To be able to get inside. Hopefully, we're just going to just go and see what it's like from the outside as well. I actually did make a list of the places that I want to visit, but I just didn't do the booking prior to. But yeah, we are going to be doing some more touring today, and I'm excited. I'm actually tired, you guys. The work of yesterday, no big joke. But the life of a tourist. Yeah, now bring the bottle. Let's put it here. Okay, let's put it here. Alright guys, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, can I have my phone, please? Thank you, baby. Okukuni, I'm welcome. So, you guys, let me just do a bit. Not me coming here thinking that it was just gonna be sun, and then like it was going to be giving purely um, summer weather. That was what I thought. But <laughs> fortunately and unfortunately, it's actually giving a colder weather. Like it's giving the proper UK weather. Not as much as not as cold as UK weather, right? But it's giving maybe like a spring weather, which is normal because we are literally entering spring already. So I'm just glad that I didn't just pack summer outfits. Because the other country that we're going to is cold as well. So I was just like in between summer and winter clothes. But I packed more of winter outfits. So that literally, yeah. That was literally the savior. Else we would be so cold. We would have looked for how to just, you know, get some other things to just lay out. But I'm just glad that we packed both for winter and summer. Oh, it's a, it's a public ride. Nice. <laughs> I fight to daddy. Ah, ah. It's a kia. <laughs>
the Casa back now, the most popular, one of the popular places to visit. I'm not sure this is the right place to get the most view, but I'm not sure this is this is the right place to get the most view. A share picture. Yeah. So, so your picture. So you guys, this is a closer look of the Casa Batleo. all right my love so we are at the famous la sagralia familia this is what the building looks like it's a very very old church i'll put all the descriptions and stops on the screen for you guys to see so you can understand what the hype is all about there are lots of people here like taking pictures videos so this is literally the biggest attraction in the whole of spain this is the one that i've been saying that we didn't get the ticket to go inside so i'm so excited <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Are you feeling good tonight? Sting got me thinking of life. 
What you say, pal? <laughs> Careful, okay? Pierced <laughs> because this is literally how it's supposed to be done, like for him. So it'd be like, Kilo de Tayman lobby, Rito, sorry, give us to help my wife, dear. Like yesterday, we were so knackered yesterday because the work of yesterday was actually low. Let me just say that yesterday we were still trying to find our way. So, like, yesterday was just testing, testing. <laughs> but today, like last night, so we had a good plan. It was all because of me, Shai. No, I was the one that flopped it. So yesterday, I was able to correct my wrongdoings. So we were able to plan our movement today. And then I started my day early because, you know, I'm the one that needs to get ready, do my makeup, blah, 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 my hair. If I want to film, get ready with me and her as well. So pretty much everything lies on me. So today, this morning, I was more, I was more responsible. <laughs> so we've done everything that we're supposed to do this morning to noon. We even did extra. And now we are back at the hotel preparing for, like, we've already ordered the lunch that we're going to have so after lunch later in the evening we'll go to the beach because you guys know that the beach is pretty much in front of me here i will not been to the beach so we need to go to the beach and have some sunset vibe during the evening and then later in the night we'll have dinner so that's pretty much the plan for the rest of the day so right now we are so now we are just going to chill and have some rest and you know rest and recuperate and I think I'm going to work as well. I don't know who works on vacation but currently you guys have not seen any vlog and it's been I think it's seven days today that I uploaded something. You guys eh, you really matter to me. The way I carry your matter for my head if I've not posted for you guys like the way it baffles me. People will now see that I upload video. You will not click instantly. Or you will not like the video. Or you will not drop a comment. Or you will be skipping my heart. Ha! God is watching you. <laughs> because I put the whole of me into this pushing out videos for you guys. And I love you guys so much. Gracias. No. What? What's these people? Come on, they were just speaking the Spanish to you. They will assume that because you are in the country, you know Spanish, like you can speak Spanish. Chopstick. Love you to deliver rice. One more more. It's not a mistake. Food has been delivered. They'll just come, they'll just be speaking Spanish to you. I don't understand. Where was I? What was I even saying before, guys? I can't even remember again. But anyways, food is here. Let me eat. I'll catch you guys soon.
loves good morning guys i literally jumped off the bed because i'm like today is our last day in spain it cannot be hard that i didn't visit the beach because yesterday evening we decided to we intended to come to the beach but Nia was asleep and by the time we woke up it was so cranky that we eventually had to scrap it and the sun was already setting like it was really getting dark so there was no point so this morning even though i've been awake since around six o'clock like few minutes to six editing so you guys could get a video to watch this morning so immediately i finished like i'm currently saving it after saving then i will upload so immediately i rounded up i had to I had to like jump off i'm like the sun is rising like the sun has even it has risen already i need to get up and get to the beach and see what it looks like and give you guys the view also the sunrise looks so amazing oh my god i look so swollen <laughs> the sunrise is amazing it's just a pity that this is not summer so you can't really enjoy much summery stuff because it's really cold you can see i have to wear my sweatshirt and herself but it's really amazing i don't understand this barrier that is here because me i intend to get to the beach i think it's on the other side this way that i came to is wrong i have to but let's see i can see some people over there let me see if i can get there oh boy you guys this is beautiful look at this <sighs> my breath is literally on hold God forbid though, but you guys get what I mean. Oh my god, this is amazing. and everything ah you guys <laughs> that reminds me there was a man on the beach he was 100 100 percent naked on the beach though thank god i was not exactly close to him so i did not see what i'm not supposed to see but you can i can clearly see his butt even from afar and i just imagine the people that are near him some people just don't there's nothing valuable about their selves anymore like about their body it is for public consumption there's no way i could have put that kind of a thing on camera but anyways this morning was it was good i got back home and i just had to get into preparing because we are supposed to go have breakfast now and we are even we've been trying to order uber but for some reason it's been like it's been hectic I, th I think because today is sunday like they're really busy i don't know so immediately i go back i just had to beat me and dress him up beat myself get ready oh. for breakfast and airport because like i mentioned we are gonna be leaving spain this morning so obviously i am ready i'm ready to go to the next country which i am not still telling you guys yet 
you are gonna find out on the next vlog all right so we're just gonna go downstairs to eat breakfast there's breakfast in the hotel we didn't even know <laughs> so yeah when we get back i'll talk to you guys before we step out of the hotel so yeah just packed up and we're currently downstairs checking out so yeah um, we are heading to the second country like I mentioned to you guys we have two countries that we are visiting so that's where we are headed now but anyways I'm gonna end this vlog here meanwhile this is the outfit to the airport <laughs> I pretty much ran into Primark yesterday to get this job this sweatshirt Cause I'm like, what what am I going to wear to the other country? Primark, Sheen, Sheen, New Balance, and that's it. So you guys, I really, really hope that you guys enjoyed our Spain vlog. And I really can't wait to share what's coming up next in the next vlog, next travel vlog. You guys should stay tuned, like my video if you haven't, subscribe if you have not, <laughs> comment down below as well. Let me know if you're anticipating the next video. Let me know if you enjoyed this one as well. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys later on the next video. I'm so, so pumped and I'm so excited. Alhamdulillah. So, see you guys soon. Peace out. <laughs> Feeling good tonight.